he sits down, he remarks that he begins to walk on air. Here and there, a forced, irrelevant giggle. How do you feel? Well, I feel very fine. <laughs> I feel very buoyant and light and uh, resilient. I feel so... This chair is not as solid as it seems to be. I have a feeling that uh, my hands are, are not resting against this chair. And I see flashes of color quite a bit. I, I see this rug, for example, uh, seems to have an awful lot of uh, compliments of uh, violet and yellow. I see a lot of violets and yellows. Do you uh, know what the exact color of this rug I might assume be? Uh, that it is gray. You assume that it was gray? Yes. All right. Now, uh, do you find any difference between one half of your body as opposed to the other half? Well, I have a sort of a wavering tendency. I don't know which half is trying to get into the other half, but somehow or other, and I seem to be going like that. <laughs> One half... It's a very me, pleasant me. feeling of nausea, and uh, I... F <laughs> and Why, did you the, laugh? Uh, Why did you laugh just now? Because the rug seems to be billowing, <laughs> pulsating. Can you influence that pulsation? Hold your breath, for instance. Take a deep breath, hold it. Did you stop the pulsation? More or less. I breathe out. Did it change again? Well, just, it gets clever, that's all. Clever? <laughs> yes. In what way does the well, it becomes clever? It seems to uh, feel that I'm going to watch it. You have, <laughs> you have the feeling that the rug feels that you are watching it. Is that correct? Well, well uh, somehow or other, I think that I'd like to rescue myself uh, from the idea that there's so many different realities here. <laughs> Somehow I feel an observer and uh, I feel as all these people are observing me and very amused and very good company. But at the same time I feel as though uh, I'm in a more exalted position. <laughs> you feel sorry for me that I'm left out of this experience? Well, I have a feeling that you're enjoying it with me. <laughs> well, I am enjoying it in a sense, yes. Would you give me a description of the first thing that you see with eyes closed and then later on I will hand over a drawing board and try to uh, draw a sketch of it, alright? Now close your eyes first. Clo close your eyes now. What do you see? Go ahead. You can open your eyes if you want to uh, draw it. No, it happens to be black. You see it purple? Yes. Well, this is just a charcoal. Look at it. Well, in my mind's eye, oh. now I see that it's charcoal. Yes, the reality of it is sort purple. of uh, disillusioned. I see. Because uh, in every, ever, it seems to me, see, I should like to find the words because I can ordinarily find them. But it seems to me that, uh, what do my, I can't seem to want to say what I want to say. And there are times uh, when I feel uh, exactly what I, I know that I know what I'm doing, you see. Oh, I do. <laughs> Somehow or other I can compose this as well as I ever did. Let's see. Why do you do that now? Well, the square is the uh, ordinary rectangle, you see. It's one of the perfect means. I know, but are you trying to reassure yourself that you're capable of drawing? Yeah, I, yes, I think that's what I would like to do. I'd like to find out what reality I'm in.